But tonight, more than 100 animals are now in protective custody at the Monterey County SPCA after being rescued from a home in Moss Landing. According to the SPCA, all of the animals are in bad condition. They say it is the largest case of farm animal neglect they've ever seen. Action News reporter Caitlin Conrad has more live from Monterey right now. Dan, these animals are emaciated. They're very weak. Some of them can't even move on their own. And the SPCA says that some of them may not have lasted another day without veterinary care. Animals are being nursed back to health at the SPCA for Monterey County after being found in deplorable conditions at a home in Moss Landing. These animals were crammed on a quarter acre lot, just ramshackle pens put together, no food, no water, very little shade. Beth Brookhauser with the SPCA says they discovered 105 animals, including cows, calves, sheep, goats, chickens, ducks, pigs, kittens, and dogs. All of them on just a quarter acre lot, each of them struggling to stay alive. Uh, she told us that her excuse was that she had gotten a bad load of hay. But that doesn't explain the condition of the dogs and the cats. That doesn't explain that the animals had no water. That doesn't explain the manure and the rotten milk everywhere and the smell and just how awful everything was. The animals were found emaciated, some of the dogs weighing half what they should, covered in fleas and many too weak to walk. Their rescue, thanks to an anonymous caller and the day of response from the SBCA. We are so thankful that they called us. Um, many of these animals would not have survived the day had we not immediately responded to the scene. The SBCA says the woman responsible did not give an explanation as to why she had so many animals. At this time, the SBCA is not releasing that woman's name. Dan. All right, thank you very much, Caitlin. The SPCA for Monterey County plans to put together the case for animal neglect and cruelty charges next week, then submit it to the district attorney's office. At that time, we may know that woman's name.